Lucas. I play for right wing. I'm 14 years old and I love playing hockey. The thing I love about hockey is that I get to meet new friends. They come over to my house, play road hockey. I go over to their house, play road hockey, and we hang out a lot. Hi, my name is Angela and I'm Lucas's mother. We relocated here from um, Toronto, Ontario. My son and my daughter both started uh, a new school. We didn't know anybody. He had a very difficult time uh, as a mother, very trying time. My son was bullied in school. I tried to get my son to participate in sports. At the time, he didn't really have an interest. And then one day he came home and he said, Mom, I want to play hockey. We contacted a father and coach here in the community about how to register Lucas in hockey and getting him hockey gear. He made some phone calls and helped to get some second hand-me-down gear to Lucas. He gave me Kids Sports phone number and advised me to call them because being a single mom, finances uh, were not the best. But I just love the feeling to come to the rink and play a game. And let's say you're getting bullied in school and stuff, it's a great way to come out, have fun, and something that you don't have to worry about. It gives a big help for a kid like me. I remember going to Lucas's first game, nervous, scared. The emotions that I felt inside were overwhelming. He was just in his own little world out there. I watched the Lucas get out there on the ice. It was like a weight was lifted off his shoulders. Nothing else in the world mattered. My favorite moment of hockey was my first goal. It happened was, I, it was three on two. Someone passed to me, I fell on my knees, I shot into the five hole. I remember him looking at me and the tears were streaming down my, my cheeks and his teammates all went over to hug him and it was like, the feeling was incredible. The smile on his face, the grin from ear to ear, to see that for, on him compared to what he was experiencing every day in school was remarkable. We know there's people there for you on the ice and care about you. So, um, yeah. That first goal, those trophies, those friends, none of this would have been possible without Maritime NHLers' help and without their fundraising. I just want to say thanks to everyone who's helping out in the community. Everybody's so kind and stuff just to do that.